I like what Bill Johnson says. Joy is the serious business of heaven. Amen. Amen. And we know Jesus in his prayer, he prayed, uh, you know, our Father who is in heaven. I want to go into the old King James there, who art in heaven. Our Father who is in heaven, holy is your name. Your kingdom come on earth as it is in heaven. Amen. Your kingdom come on earth as it is in heaven. So what is the business of heaven? It's joy. So our goal and our hearts and our, and our mandate from the Father is to bring joy to, he- to earth. Amen. Amen. Joy to the world. Who knows that song? Amen. I bring you great news or good news of great joy when the angels came and saw the shepherds and Jesus was about to be born. Uh, good news of great joy. Why? The Son of Man is about to be born. God Himself. Amen? So it's great joy as believers. So we're going to get some stuff and hopefully by the end we'll be laughing. <laughs> uh, and? Yeah. And um, God actually commands us to be joyful. Amen. And we'll see at the end, you know, it I, I, doesn't matter whether you're struggling with depression, son, I want you to be joyful. It doesn't matter whether you're struggling because you think you have, you know, a, a, a lack and you don't have, I want you to be joyful. Anyway, let's, let me not jump ahead of myself. The fruit of the Spirit, and we're in the series at the moment, and this one is called Joy. And um, so big question number one. Well, let me say this first, actually, before we get to number one. You know the word happiness? You know the word happiness? You know it comes from the, from the word happenstance. Originally Old English, happenstance, which actually was the same as luck. And you know that luck, shoo, hey, you were lucky, you won that. Hey, you, you were so lucky. It's like the lucky, rabbit, the lucky charm. Or the lucky rabbit's foot. Not so lucky for the rabbit. <laughs> Amen. So, uh, luck, there is no such thing as luck. Because happenstance actually, happenstance is, is, is centered around my circumstance, my, my circumstances. And it just happens to be a good one, and so therefore I'm lucky. It's like, if you don't believe in God, then you must believe you're very lucky to have our earth situated just exactly the right distance from the sun in order to have life. So we're very lucky. You understand what I'm saying? Just circumstantially, it's just, whew, we just made that one. <laughs> and like I said last week, when you tuck into your nice big farmhouse breakfast from wherever, you know, and you look at your plate, you go, you look at your wife and you go, or your girlfriend or whatever, and your friend, you say, how lucky are we? Look, d- come on, let's just thank the universe. <laughs> how lucky are we that we can get all the stuff that it just happened to evolve with us. I mean, talk about luck. I mean, who likes nice... You know, where's John and Jenny? I don't know if they're even here. Well, there they are. Thank you for the Kentucky the other night. Dawn is not well, as I said. Friday night, she's like, they're uh, uh, thinking about dinner. I'm like, yeah, because I'm hungry. <laughs> no. no. And uh, she goes, I'm going to think about dinner. And next, I don't know how long after the phone call, Jenny phones and says, hey, we want to bring Kentucky to our house. And both my kids love Kentucky. So when I picked Torna from school, I said, guess what you're having for dinner tonight? What? Kentucky. <laughs> you know, you have a nice crispy chicken, and you're like, well, aren't we just lucky that this evolved with us? A chicken, a chicken just evolved from mud. And a nice pork, sausage, you know? Pooh was going to miss Piglet, but he really enjoyed that bacon sandwich. (laughs) And then my son had another one. Piglet was going to miss Pooh, but he really enjoyed that sandwich. Anyway, so everything in the world is based on luck. You just happen to be. You just happen to be. We just everything just is just lucky. Actually, there's no such thing as luck. Yeah. Amen. Now, I do believe in coincidences that are just kind of freaky, but I also believe in God incidences, yeah. where God has orchestrated 
created that the earth is exactly this far away from the sun. That God himself has created all these things that we can have a massive farmhouse breakfast and honey with our tea. Amen? And sugar with our stuff and cocoa and chocolate and you just name it. God has made all these things for our enjoyment. We're not lucky. We're blessed. Amen. Amen. And so we can be very joyful. 